Welcome back. This is still Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. Our guest is someone who says he's ready to take on the controversy field hip hop and rap scene in Nigeria and Africa at large. While in school, he won the 2014 edition of um, Pepsi Chat Show in University of Lagos. He raps and sings in English, Pidgin, Yoruba, and Igbo while exploring other languages. He draws his inspiration from the likes of Sakodi, Vector, Emma Yabaga, Wande Ko, Whiskey, and Bonaboy. With dozen singles and and a seven-track EP. Let's make welcome the one and only Brainy. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All these, 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 Okay, before we get into brainy and where you got brainy from, yeah. if that's the size of your brain, I don't know. <laughs> but <laughs> what do you think about what Kanye is fighting for and how he's going about it? Well, rumors have it that um, the record label scene abroad, so mm -hmm. to speak, have always been a um, um, situation of the slave and the master. Mm -hmm. So it's really no biggie hearing Kanye come out to say it. I think he's um, the one who has the B-A-L-L-S to mm -hmm. come out and say it. And then the others not being bold enough to come out to say it is basically how humans are. Mm -hmm. One person always has to take the fall for every other person. So Kanye is doing it. It's fine. Let's so him enjoy what, it. what do you think about how he's doing it, how he's going about it? To be very honest, to be very <laughs> honest, I feel everyone has the right to react mm. whatsoever or however so they... On our word, if you've expressed, I'm not Kanye though. <laughs> 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 I'm not Kanye, so you don't have to be a LLS for that, yeah. No, 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 no. Okay. no, I don't think I, I have enough. Um, be a LLS. <laughs> <laughs> all righty, okay. Yeah. So, I, I've watched your, some of your interviews before. Mm -hmm. Seeing your growth is quite inspirational. I think you've Thank done you. very well for yourself. You. you mentioned before though that you weren't in a record label. And yes. you're in management. And you threw off the person I was in the interview. You threw me off as well, but you tried to explain it. Has there been any updates on that? So are you now in a record label? Do you have a proper team? Is there any growth yes. so far? Yes, I'm um, officially signed on the FZ Music. That's mm -hmm. the home level for EMI LAD. Mm. So yes, that's been growth. That explains mm. a lot of love <laughs> that you have been showing these people. What okay, have I been showing people, okay, please? Okay, okay. Mm. You have, how, how is mm. it working with Yemi Alade? Because I think she's one woman I admire in the industry. Yeah. Mm. I think she's also one woman that doesn't get a lot of accolades as I mm. think she should get. So how is it working it with her? Well, to me, I feel it's, it depends where you are expecting the accolades to come from. Mm. I feel Yemi is getting enough accolades. To me, because mm. she's doing it. Yeah. She's doing it, trust me. Working with her is... Working with her is... Um, work. <laughs> no, no. I, you wake up every morning and Yemi Alade just wants to make a new song. Mm. And you're a young artist who hasn't, like, to me, I, I, I haven't reached 15% um, of what Yemi Alade has done. Mm -hmm. So waking up every morning and you're seeing her wanting to make more music and you're pressing your phone. Mm. <laughs> My brother, you need to sip some tea. Mm. Okay, let's go into the fact that you mentioned that music kind of chose you. So you, yeah. it wasn't even your thing. Yeah. Um, and your name, Brainy, kind of shows that you were a book boy. But then music came for you. So is that it? Were you a book boy? I was. I am still a book boy. Valedictorian mm. even. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, yes. How, your parents you, how did you do this homework? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> What is going on? How do your parents feel about that? Your their valedictorian son mm -hmm. and they must have tied Gilly for to go to graduation, told all their friends is now singing music. Well, it's, it was just my mom. Mm -hmm. okay. It's always been just my mom. Okay. So and I'm the only child. Okay. And you can imagine how it is for your only child to tell you that, man, this music I want to do, man. And I want to go and perform, I want to travel the world and make music. Mm. And your mom is looking at you like <laughs> After all the things I've done oh. to train in school, yeah. you must be a fuck up one. <laughs> <laughs> and that was, it, it's, it was really, really um, hard for me when I started off because um, I remember using my jam fee hmm. <laughs> to buy a music form. Oh, wow. And then that was where my mother was like, this boy has really run mad. <laughs> then sent him out of the house. I was in the studio. I slept in the studio for months. Oh. Wow. And then that was prior to the Pepsi challenge and I happened to win. And then after I won, 
I was called back to the house. <laughs> <laughs> and I was asking, if you want to be a rebel, you have to be winning at the same time. <laughs> I, was, I was asked them, do you really want to go to school? Mm. But you know you have to go to school. Yeah. Even if you want to make music. I was like, I want to go to school now. There's no way I will not go to school, but I want to do music. Okay. I can't work for anyone. And I was like, oh, I don't know. So where's the one million you won? <laughs> <laughs> so that was just basically how music yeah. started for me 2014, 2015. I put out a 17 track mixtape wow. when I was in school. Then that gave me like a solid standing in lag as one of the top artists from in lag. So mm. I was I was basically topping charts from year one to my final year. Unilag lag is a huge platform on exactly. its own. Exactly. Mm. And that was to be very honest, it's, it sounds like a funny story, but mm -hmm. one of the reasons I wrote post jam for in lag was I needed the yeah. audience yeah. in yeah. lag because I was in Yaba Tech studying Mascom and then I wrote jam for you mm. and the only thing in my head i remember walking into you lag the first time i went to write my post jam that morning and the only thing i said looking at the gate was god i just need this i just need this admission i want to perform in this school <laughs> that was what i said <laughs> I, I wasn't even going to the school to go well, get any something. degree nah. right. but at least you got the degree i got the degree great got the so degree. what are you working on now what should we be expecting mm. at all mm, more singles mm -hmm. I was supposed to put out a body of work this year. It might come out, it might not come out, oh, depending what's, what's depending on my mood. Oh, shit. I wake up in the morning and I'm like, mm, it. let me be a Kanye, let me oh, put it out. You know, it's on the song it. even. Yeah. <laughs> I did not say anything. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say anything. Okay, but, yeah. well, something coming what's out soon. You give us something, yeah, what's I, the intention I, I, behind I, it? Mm, what's the song like? What's the vibe like? Okay, I'm releasing the song tomorrow titled O Baby. Um, that's... Because I feel like I've heard of baby before. Hmm. Yeah, oh baby, my baby. Okay. No, 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 I doubt, I doubt, I doubt. Because I released the song May 22nd titled Girls. Okay. And then I released the I'm a Piano Remix last mm. week titled Girls and My Piano Remix. Mm. And then I feel like, mm, since I'm riding on the wave of making music for girls, let's give one to the babies. Mm. So I called it the baby and I'm putting it out, so. Okay, and that's tomorrow, yeah? Yeah, tomorrow. Okay, we'll definitely be looking you, out for you, that You sing a lot of love, a lot of love. Is there a, a <coughs> love person in your life, mm. you know? Like an actual... As a muse. You know. Mm -hmm. As a muse. You're real mm -hmm. muse. I'm amused. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you will still answer the question. You will still answer. Yes. Who is the And this, this, this interview is well, wait, I have, I have a question. I have a question. Mm -hmm. is, this, is this our cup of tea or your cup of tea uh, or my cup uh, of tea? All of us. All of us. Tea. Then, uh, let's, then let's have a cup of tea. Don't, don't worry. <laughs> it's Did okay. I'm a person. I'm a person. Who is the muse? <laughs> Who is she? Who are they? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, why are you putting me on this spot? Is, is this, there someone? It's nice. Why, if there's what? someone beautiful that is being your muse and giving you all this, this bad she should what, be proud. What, to what be if it's what if it's not just one person? What if it's more than one? I just say it. There are more than one. One yeah? person that you are feeling. <sighs> mm. I'm sorry for you. This night, your phone. Oh, you're in trouble. So you're with feeling that everybody, and they're <laughs> motivating you. Okay, so it's time to give us something, something like a song that came from one of the motivations. Yes. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> don't judge. See, no matter I can like anybody I want. Okay. Wow. Whether I'm a Londoner or a Jamu B, but I can like anybody at once. Mm -hmm. okay. I like Oloni. She be feminist. Feminist like women on top. Mm -hmm. And I like those two kids in front. They so back here that the bubble can rub. Mm -hmm. I like girls in twos, Baba. I like girls with crews, Baba. Five for life girls with Jews, Baba. What if you make me confused, Mama? See, let me just stop there. It's fine. <laughs> you, you, you get the point, Abby. <laughs> I got the point. Thank get you, Thank you, Granny, for drinking <laughs> tea with us. I, I, I see you are enjoying the tea more than we are doing. That's, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. And <laughs> thank you for watching. And please do send your opinions via WhatsApp to 90 or tweet at us at Plus TV Africa. Remember, you can catch up on this episode and all our exclusive content by subscribing to our YouTube channel at Plus TV Africa. My thank you as always to go to my co anchors, Ife Omai and Ife Olu Washington, and our guest, Brainy. Thank you thank for being you. here. Thank you. And the entire production team. Thank you for watching Plus TV Africa's Tea Time. My name is Elsie Godwin. Stay safe.